Welcome back on the channel guys, VST here at Apple Tech and I have the beloved Galaxy Samsung S23 Ultra. Now, heading directly to the Galaxy Store as there are some applications and updates, Samsung stock application updates, Samsung Gallery, the Find My Mobile, check out members, even a new version for Logstar which corrects some things for GTS which is one nice fine model from Good Lock, which we cannot currently use because it's Geolock for just South Korea and Smartings framework. But I checked all of those and okay, let me share it guys. Samsung Gallery, right? There is a new version, but okay, there is a bug fix. We don't know even which bug, so I don't want to really bore you with these things, they don't really matter. But there is a new version for the nearby device scanning. Shows TV, DA, Smart Tech, Easy Pair pop up when SmartThings is uninstalled. Now, if you go inside your settings and you start searching for device, you're gonna get something here. Nearby device scanning, connections, more connection settings. So if you are to go to connections, right, and scroll down to more connection settings, it's very deep in the menus. There is something called nearby device scanning, which apparently can turn on and off, but if you're using like me, the Samsung Galaxy Watch and also the butts, right? Probably even all smart devices. Well, this can really help you. So what is the nearby device scanning, guys? It will allow your phone to scan for devices that are nearby, which I think sounds logical, but it'll also let you connect to them in a pop-up or in the notification panel. And of course, I'm gonna show you. So your phone will scan for devices even when the Bluetooth is turned off. So what I'm gonna do right now, guys, I'm going to disable my Bluetooth, right? And why? I am doing this video guys, see there is an end here about nearby device scanning which apparently will show us there is an update and that's the very same update that is in here, 15 megabytes from the 9th of May, it's version 11.1.11.4. So I'm gonna hit the update button guys and I'm gonna show you how I am connecting my Buds Pro using this marvelous marvelous battery widget, right? And as I am updating it by the way, I'm gonna do it even right now on the camera, guys. Seems that nothing has happened. Boom, but it's there. Connect, all right. So I can apparently connect to my butts even without using the Bluetooth, which is actually quite nice. So as you can see here, guys, I have information on uh, my Watch 5 Pro. It just switched on the Bluetooth, but what I wanna do, guys, I wanna kill the Bluetooth, all right, which immediately will remove the watch so right now guys if i am just to open my buds 2 pro let me just try to open the lid and see what is going to happen okay so are we now able to connect the samsung galaxy buds 2 pro yes we are so it appears uh, like this and it's very fancy so let me just hit the connect button and guys yeah we know that this doesn't really work for the watch how do we know because i'm going to open right now galaxy wearable and you can just see there is no link Okay, so your watch isn't connected to your phone, so I need to press the connect, which apparently will switch on the Bluetooth. And while switching on the Bluetooth, of course, I'm gonna get here the statistics, hopefully. So now I should be connected. And now guys, I should have like the holy grail of the Samsung accessories. So why? Because here guys, that's apparently my phone. That's here my watch, that's my butts, and that's the case. And here I am also able to see everything in this shape. So my phone, my watch, my Buds 2 Pro and my Buds 2 Pro case. And we also know that when I turn off the Bluetooth guys, boom, everything disappears. And I also know that I am able to connect to my Samsung Galaxy Buds 2 Pro without using the Bluetooth, all right? Just by using this device um, nearby scan function, see Bluetooth is off. And the moment, by the way, the moment I actually try to do so guys, boom, Bluetooth turns on. So if I am now to switch off Bluetooth, yeah, it will scan devices and it will let you connect, even if the Bluetooth is turned off. But this doesn't really apply for the watch. But the moment you want to connect with them, of course, you're gonna need the Bluetooth. So go there, update the nearby device scanning, guys, and enjoy your Samsung Echo system. With that said, VST over and bye.